the bear buddy okay here's a real quick one to get your uh, daz 8.1 characters into character creator okay this is for 8.1 into character creator right so i've got an 8.1 here 8.1 8.1 character right here in a viewport uh put some clothes on her put some hair on her look first thing we're going to do is we're going to take and we're going to delete the tear duct the tears and we're going to delete the eyebrows okay so those are gone we good we good Second thing we want to do is we want to select our character, go to Tools, and Joint Editor, right? Now you get this little red arrow in there, right there, right there. You're going to make sure it's highlighted. Right-click and say Edit and Rename Node. Now you get Genesis 8 underscore 1 female. We're going to take away the 1 and the underscore. So it says Genesis 8 female, okay? We're going to copy that, and under Node Label, we're going to paste Genesis 8 female. So Genesis 8 female, blah, 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 blah. Okay, we got that done. Cool. Say accept. Last thing or second last thing we want to do is we want to put her, you can click here to get rid of the joint editor. Um, this little thing here, see that? And then it gets rid of the joint editor. Now we want to put this into an A pose, right? So if you go to your program files uh, and you go look for your installation of character creator 4. So program files, you go into character creator 4, you're going to program as assets <laughs> all right external files daz resource and a pose okay and under daz uh resources you'll get t poses and you'll get a poses and you can install these into daz so you never have to go into this thing again but for now we're just going to take this and we're going to take the g81 female a pose and we're just going to drag and drop it onto her Okay, that'll convert her into the A pose. Boom, there we go. All good. Like I said, you can install these into Genesis and then you can, uh, Daz, and then you can just just come here and do it. Uh, but that's, uh, you know, there's a lot of tutorials online for you to see that and you can go check that one out. Right, and the last thing we want to do, the last, last thing we want to do is take go into Genesis A female, uh, select your hair and your clothes, and you're just going to right click them and say, Unparent, unparented selected items, right? So if I close this now, you see I've got Genesis 8 and I've got these separated. Now this kind of just works better. A lot of people say it works better. I'm the same. It works better, feel better. I'm going to deselect everything, okay? Deselect everything, go into File, Export. And over here, I'm going to call it Girl. And you can see I've already got a Girl there, but uh, just ignore that one. Give it a name. Uh, and then you're going to say include figures. Yeah, over here. So if I just wanted to do like a selection, if I just wanted to go with no clothes or something, I can say selected only, or if things are turned off, the eyeballs and, they, and they're not visible, you can say visible only. But for now, I wanted everything. I wanted to export everything. So I just left, uh, you know, I didn't select anything and it'll it'll just take everything now include figures include props uh and you can you can just follow these settings i mean you don't need all of them but you know this works so uh there it is okay you've seen it great except now it'll uh save our uh character into an a pose everything's good it'll export the fbx and once they're done once they're done we can go off to character creator right so now that we're in character creator we're going to take transformer cc3 plus okay cc3 plus is for 8.1 so cc3 plus we're gonna go select our girl open it up girl let me tell you how much i love you now we're gonna wait and now it's in god's hands if everything went right we'll get advanced or basic here we go all good so we're gonna take advanced now look there's a plugin you can buy for character creator called skin gen it's awesome uh if i had that i would not touch anything here I'd just import i'll set these things and import but a lot of people don't have that because it can't moan it. It can't moan it, okay? So if you don't have skin gen, you can say bake body textures. You can say generate a profile. You can give it a name over here. Uh, and, it, and it can be a profile that you use for all 8.1s going forward. Now, look, I've already got one, but you can just give it a file name there. I'm going to say 8 underscore 1 or whatever. And you can use that going forward for all of your Genesis 8.1 females, okay? You can save it. Yes, sure, sure. Uh, I'm going to say uh, texture size 2K. You can put it 4K, whatever the hell you want. Texture folder. I'm just going to click over here and I'm going to create a new folder called textures. I've already got one. I'm going to double click it and say select folder, dem folder. All right. Now over here, we're going to say eyelashes default. Uh, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to put that onto uh, type. Uh, wait, hold on. 
hold on one second, people. Hold on, hold on. Let me just divide this. My God. Genesis 8.1 eyelashes. Type is cloth. The dress is cloth. I'm going to leave that to cloth, the eyelashes. Dress, I'm going to cloth. Yes. And the hair, I'm going to change that to hair, brows and beard. Okay. Now you can set individual texture resolutions for each of these. I'm just going to leave them like this for right now, just so that we know. Now, if you forgot to put your T-pose, okay, or your A-pose for, for uh, other characters, you can get them over here. It says get A-pose for CC3+. Plus. You can click that. It'll open up this directory, and you can literally click uh, Genesis 8 female A-pose. You can do it here. So if you did forget to do it in Daz, you can just do it there. Right, we've got everything sorted. We say okay. Now we wait 20, 30 years, okay? Okay, come on, baby. Come on, baby. It's all good. And we wait and we wait. Like I said, there's a lot of in-depth tutorials on this on, online uh, that'll take you to a, a lot better things. But this is just a quick guide to get you up and running very so quickly. Yeah? Ganz schnell. Das ist richtig ganz schnell. Wir können machen sehr, sehr schnell in sie schleppen. Right, and that's as far as my German goes. Uh, not very good. Lived here for years. Can't say a word, but, uh, you know, I'm learning. I can say, gives me Essen. Yeah, gives me dein Essen. Yeah. Schletzen. I'm sure Schletzen's a word. I'm not sure yet. But let's have a look. Okay, once this is done, I'll return, and we can go from there. Right, it's nearly there. There you go. It's all there. And looking good, boys. Now, the one thing that I have troubles with always, I don't know why. Maybe it's just a me thing, but, you know, maybe it's a good thing because if it happens to you, you know how to fix it. There's no textures on the body. Why? Why is there always that one little damn thing? Huh? Always, always, bro. Anyway, so we can go into here, materials, and we can go up here like this, and we can say body, skin, head, skin, body. We're looking for the body, skin, body. And over here, you can just right-click, texture, file, load, and you can go load that body, and you're good to go, okay? Uh, from there, now, this is using all of Daz's uh, materials, texture, texture, texture. So you can see like a couple of things that are a little bit odd. Um, the nice thing about being in here is you can always override everything, which is cool. Like you can go into the eyes, the eye templates, and you can say, hell, I don't want them eyes, because you've got to go in and fix all the materials for them. There's a couple of things you can fix up and you'll get it right. But Or you can just change it straight over to their eyes, which is awesome. Their eyes are really beautiful. Yeah, beautiful eyes. And that's the same thing. You can go into skin gen. You can change the skin. You can use all of the cool kind of skins that come with... Uh, with uh, character creator, and it's it's really nice. So there we go. There's your character inside of character creator. You can then go in. You can change it to skin gen. You can you can change everything about them. You can tweak all the materials. I don't know what the hell is happening there, but obviously you can fix that. But there we go. There's your character inside of CC uh, character creator four. Anyway, I hope that helps. We'll go into a lot more in depth things. We'll take we'll we'll show you how to really do up the character nicely. And we'll take that into Unreal 5 and we'll make something beautiful from it, okay? But for now, there's your character inside of CC. That's a Genesis 8.1. It's a little different to the 8s. Uh, but there we go. Hope it helps and see you soon. Bye, guys.